Hey gang, first cinema camera explore today. We are looking for Brocklands Adventure Park. Yeah. So we saw this uh, notice of application for planning permission here, thinking it was possibly this place, but it wasn't. So we did a little bit more poking around. See how modern this is, it's only literally written about six days ago by the looks of it. Yeah, so we're walking down, this is the sketchiest path ever. <laughs> Um, this is where they would have led the kids down for their fun time. Um, we think the building to the left here is possibly, yeah, the... Uh, hearing all kinds of weird, like, machinery. Yeah, there are some very strange noises. We think that was, like, the fun park. Yeah, so it's like an indoor slide and ball pit sort of thing. Yeah. We're pretty sure it is, but it looks like something out of a, a, a horror film, <laughs> the slidey door. Pixieland Tea and Rooms and Shop was established in 1977. Guests were treated to a quirky reception by Georgie a blue-crested Amazon parrot. The park featured a 200-seater restaurant, the Brock Bowl, which was a four-lane bowling alley, undercover play area with slides, bouncy castle, trampoline, bumper boats, quad bikes, and a ride on a train called Pioneer. Horse track rides were taken on Honey, the Welsh mountain pony, leading guests past a wildlife pond, providing a haven for local wildlife. Nearby was Pixieland Mini Farm, featuring livestock, rabbits, guinea pigs, and ornamental pheasants. Further exotic animals like iguanas, snakes, tropical fish, parrots, and Ricky the raccoon were later added. The click-on center featured eight computers and a display of stuffed birds. Local photographer Russ Hodinot supplied the accompanying photos. Brooklyn's Adventure Park closed in 2007 when Sue and Dennis retired. The diesel train was donated to Sherwood Forest Railway. So I think this is the uh, go-kart track here. Wow. Okay, so we think this is a go-kart track. Yeah. Um, this is like the pit stop area. It's crazy, it just bombs out and around. But... Imagine the kids having so much fun. It's like some kind of storage. Locking the bird feeders out. Seems like a storage area here. Oh, have you got torch? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, we haven't got torches, but the camera's pretty good for the low lights. So. What's that, like a fuse box, is it? Or? Medical box. God. And there's a soap dispenser. We just found a bow and arrow. Yeah. It's an <laughs> arrow. That's the target. Yeah, that was a super target. Look, huge. Nothing drawn on it. I've got drawers here. All the old stuff. We've got plugs and fuses, wheel bearings. It's all the parts then. Keep the go-karts moving. Smart plugs. Oh, there's one of the things that go on your wrist to stop you from getting whacked by the bow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. That's a bearing, huh? Wheel bearing. Trays of goodies. Stupid. Something down listen, there. Listen, listen. Ooh. You hear it? Yeah, like a rat, is it? I had a squeak then. Eh? Listen to it. Is it in the bin? It was a butterfly guy. <laughs> yeah, it's multiple. Uh, Fabi is like in the park. It's just interesting, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Like the rustiness of the drawers is really cool as well. Yeah. Probably pay like a fortune for that, for like a movie set kind of piece. Mm. <clears throat> There's another great big target behind you. Yeah, huge, great uh, round one here. Oh, look, it's still got a target on it. <laughs> Are they any good? Not bad. That butterfly's doing me in. <laughs> it's just this bed for the winter. <laughs> yeah. I'm probably like really annoyed, that poor butterfly. Oh. This is a really cool place. Yeah, there's an oil box. Oil filler cap. <laughs> Got the uh, A team in here. You can build a go kart to escape on. Oh, oh they're traps. Traps? Yeah. It's a trap box. Oh gosh, yeah. There's a trap. Bloody hell. 
They've obviously got an infestation of something here. <laughs> don't, let it, don't let it snap. That's a serious trap, isn't it? Yeah, wow. That's some spring on that. What the hell are they going to catch with that? Should try and figure out how it works and then trap it and then get it with a stick. Yeah, Fabio's laying a trap. If we don't know who for you. Yeah. <laughs> That's going to be really loud. Let's get it with a stick. Just put your foot on it. Oh. Ready? Slow mo shot. I can do, hang on, I can do slow mo. <laughs> okay gang, we're gonna walk the track. We don't think it's <laughs> don't think it's gonna be a long walk, but we're gonna walk it anyway. We're just trying to imagine little kids uh, going round here. No, we're not. <laughs> no, no, we could get demonetized for that thought. Uh, <laughs> All right, through the little archway. Oh, look, 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 it's growing kiwis. Oh my God. It's a kiwi tree. Wow. God, they're like ripe as well, look. Eat one. I'll definitely eat one. There's loads of them. There's our kiwis. They're dangling down. Let's get some. Oh look, there's a, there's a group of three. So we'll put those in that. <laughs> you can't see them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What do they feel like? Furry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I think it's covered the whole branch. Yeah, I've never actually seen a kiwi tree before, or a kiwi vine. It's very similar to like a grape, sort of grape viney thing. This is cool. Oh, we lost another one. <laughs> so we're going to go further down here. I reckon it got shut down because there's no help and tape. Yeah, it does seem really sketchy, this place. Huh. Yeah, it must have gone all the way over there. Wow. This has got to be toilets. Got to look what's left of the door. Oh my god. So we found tanks. From, from, from yeah. the pictures we can tell that they might be like animal well, enclosures. Creatures to look out for here. Adventure. Oh, is this a map? No, that's just a map of everything. Uh, oh no, it's the habitat and everything as well. Look, by yeah, all birds and animals on display are road casualties. Oh god, so it was a taxidermy thing. Or died of natural So they're all causes. dead. Oh god, so they like all these were like it. just dead in here. Is there anything in there, or have they been taken? Look, it's oh, it's a pheasant. Yeah, it's pheasant feathers. Someone's kicked the crap out of the place. Ooh. It's got proper horror movie vibes to this. It does proper stink in it, guys. Mm. No, it's just an empty room. Oh, okay, nothing in there, it? Got more things here. God, there's things all over the place, look. Creatures. Let's get out there, I, I wasn't expecting this to be here. You in? Oh, you there. <laughs> yeah, sorry. I was just getting some arty shots. And this is a board, maybe? It said what stuff was? Yeah, well, like the next step of the journey, isn't it? To the taxidermy palace thing. We just found a cre creature. Oh, this brain's coming out, look. What? <laughs> Gonna leave that creature's brains alone, I think. I'm gonna carry on. This path zigzags all over the place. It's like something out of Jurassic Park. It's like a fan. <laughs> you can cook things in those. It is a strange feeling, isn't it? Feels like, like something. Yeah, well, like something sinister's happened here, and you're like following in the footsteps of it all. I can hear like a river getting louder and louder. Oh, John, we've come to a fork. 
Oh no, okay, so we can go left or right here. What does that say on the team? Work, mate. Oh. This must have been the check-in station. So that's where the other fork goes off there. Feels really creepy being sat in here. Right, back through the bamboo. Go onwards. A carpet of red along here. Yeah, I am. I'm losing grip going up here. Well, here's the other side of the tree. Not the tree house, sorry, the zip wire. Obviously, you used to go around right through the trees by the looks of it. Observation of the, uh, of the video here. Next time on Street Zips.